The song production sounds good and the video, like, I like his outfits more than the song, but I'm not really impressed with his lyrics and stuff because, hey yo, what's good? Welcome back to another episode of Smash Your Pass. My name is V. If you're watching this for the very first time, what happens is we just play a music video. We talk about the video production, the audio production, just however I feel about the song. And this is strictly for entertainment purposes. So make sure when you drop in the comments, make them, you know, a little bit friendly. This is Charisma and it's called Guanu. This is the very first time I'm reviewing a Charisma my video i don't know why i haven't reviewed any of his songs before but anyways this is the very first time so let's just get into it play that before i jump into the whole video let's talk about his outfit i like it i think it's nice. It's just it's just denim with some drawings in there. You can never go wrong with denim. I know everyone else talks about how Charisma is the best dresser when it comes to Malawian artists. So I totally agree. You're my destiny. Don't worry about the girls. They are the girls. Girl that dead to me. The Gupangas are away. Old Indine. Come and dance with me. I know you like my game, I got game like a full peach. Well, up a full peach. They said I got game like a full peach. You know, you know, charisma, I think he just writes whatever comes to his head. I think I just like these words, they're gonna go along, so let me just write to him. I think he has fun with words. That's one thing that makes him charisma, that's what makes him him. I've actually never heard like a very serious lyric from him. Most of them, they're just like fun type of lyrics, which is good, you know, which is good. I'm not complaining. The song production sounds good and the video is a fashion killer. So, you know, you can never go wrong. The video is nice, very clear and it's not too much happening. So I like it. Wow. Three outfits already and they're all great. Wow. I'm actually more attracted to the video more than the audio, more than the song itself. I don't know if that makes sense, but I think it's just because the video is nice to look at uh, with the way that he's dressing, maybe because of his outfits. I've actually never reviewed a charisma song before. This is my very first time. I'm not complaining. I like his outfits. You know, I'm actually more attracted to the video more than the song itself. I don't know if that makes sense, but I think it's just because the video is nice to look at. It's sweet. It's it's catchy. I think everyone else is going for catchy songs right now, but I'm not really impressed with his lyrics and stuff because, you know, I think it's something that I've heard before honestly you know but it's it's nice it's nice i'm not complaining nice. I don't know if I'm wrong or right. Correct me if I'm wrong. But I think when it comes to charisma, he is more concerned about his outfits than the song itself. I don't know if I'm wrong or right. It's like, you know, I've recorded this song, but what am I going to wear? And then that's where the whole energy goes into. That's what I think. So I like the fact that he sings, he raps. He's just on his own lane, you know, so he's very comfortable wherever he is. But I, I don't have any problems with the song. It's a smash and a pass at the same time. I think the video stands out more than the song itself. That's my personal view, so. I think I think Malawian artists you are overworking the Kamburi sisters, you know, like the song can be so dry, but it they give life to a song. I didn't expect to hear them on this type of beat, but it was a great surprise. I'm actually surprised they spiced up the song because the hook was a bit you know what I mean. That's why they jumped in. So yeah. Let me know what you think. If you've watched it, yeah, drop down your thoughts and keep them friendly like always. I'm definitely gonna see you on the next video. Peace out.